Hello everybody and welcome back to Pokemon Black. In the last one, we got this cute little guy right here. Hold on, let's show him off. There he is. <laughs> cute little guy. Just a precious little boy. I do like this ability better than the unnerved one. <laughs> Alright, but in the last one, we got through Route 6. We made it to Charge Stone Cave and we caught that little guy. And now we're almost at the halfway point. What do these guys do? Hi, we're the Nugget Brothers. I'm the big brother. And I'm the little brother of the Nugget Brothers. Glad you showed up. I want to give you this. I got a nugget. I want to give you this too. We got another nugget. Sweet nuggets. Alright, so, um... I think we're gonna be battling some Team Plasma members. If I remember correctly, I think we are. Let's see. Um, this rock tomb is fine. Because I know you can't really touch it. Or, oh. <laughs> I thought that would do more. Oh, great. Oh, no. I don't like this guy at all. I'm just gonna run away. <laughs> Java update? Can you not? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> There's the doctor. Sweet. If you like, I can make your Pokemon healthy. However, let me challenge you to a battle first. I guess that is how this universe works is you have to fight for your health insurance. <laughs> God, you know how many fights I would lose with healthcare if, like, you had to beat up the doctor to get some some healthcare? I would not be able to get healthy at all. <laughs> oh, we do not have the right Pokemon out for this one. Um, yeah, let's, let's just see how Jasper does. We're gonna get healed anyway, so crunch. Okay, so we just got slowed down. Okay. Man, Jasper looks so cool in this form. Wish we could see her in the front more, cause like she's got a, like our arms crossed, looking all like cool. We're still faster. I guess, I guess Swaboon is kind of slow. <laughs> Hyper potion. No. I hope I crunch you in your defense. <laughs> God damn it. God damn it. Alright, I, I, I don't have a fucking fire type, but I, I do have, uh, Cosmo. God, these headphones I got are so good. I, um, I was out at GameStop with my boy, and, um, I wanted to get headphones. I don't have a mic. This one technically does, but it's not- I just realized that you can just, like, if you look at the, the settings on the computer, It'll ask you what your output and your input, uh, what, what you would want your output and input to be. So I just made it so the mic, which is the input, is the the razor mic that I have, and then my output is the headphones. That way, like even if I touch the mic, you won't hear the mic, you know. So, wait, hold on. Now you can't hear it because I'm looking at the mic thing on the. An OBS and it's not really going up when I hit the mic, but it does when I hit this mic, so that means it's working. <laughs> to make people healthy, doctors go where they're needed. Yeah, I guess you're right. No, there's speed pause. <laughs> no, I should probably turn. Yep. Ah, oh, I think. Oh, it's fine. It's probably not that important. <laughs> Look, it's a little guy again. There's a lot of males coming out. Oh, this thing is so dead to us. <laughs> wait. Oh, uh, wait, wait a minute. What the fuck is Joltik weak against? Where's my phone? <laughs> oh, it's over there. My ability was suppressed. Oh, I can't use Moxie anymore? I'll just crunch it. Maybe it's rock. Hold on. Now I gotta look. Uh, Joltik. Weakness. Uh, 
Wait, it's just rock and fire? I thought it was weak against flying too. Wait, hold on. I don't believe this. I don't know, I'm going on the, the game thing. <laughs> so I'm gonna try. Oh, there's an item right there. <laughs> God damn it. There it is, game data. There's entries. I need like Oh, it's it's really just rock and fire. Wow, I really didn't think like bug could be combined with something good like that, but okay. Oh yeah, Rock doesn't do shit against this thing. Wait. Wait, what kind of move is- oh, it's gr- <laughs> I'm so stupid. I thought it was- well, even if it was a bug or dark. Uh, I kind of want to put out a bell. <laughs> Here, let, let me throw away the same spot of the week. Yeah. Let me see if we have any repels in my bag. <laughs> Let's see. We should have picked up some, right? God, this is so unorganized. Hold on. We don't have a single repel. Oh, here it is. Alright. I was in you for a little bit. Oh, it's in the wall. Oh, oh, there's a thing right there. So, cool thing about the uh, caves is that um, sometimes it's this it's kind of treated like rustling grass slightly, where if you go on it, you are more likely to find rare Pokemon, mainly. Uh, Drillber and extra drill, but there's a chance that you could find gems that power up attacks, like certain attacks, and you could also find stones, like evolution stones. But I don't know if that's a like a black and white two thing or if it's also this game. But at least you can get gems too. You, you came here because someone manipulated you. <laughs> if you can win against me, I'll tell you the secret. All right. Maybe it's a requirement to have orange hair to join Team Plasma. <laughs> I'm thinking about it more and more and- Oh my god, your thing is not evolved yet? Bro, look at mine. Deal with the times. <laughs> it's probably not a good match, even though I am stronger. Alright, Kai. Man, I really can't believe Joltik is just weak against rock and fire. I thought it was something else, too. I didn't know the the bug got rid of its ground type weakness, but that's that's honestly pretty cool. <laughs> there we go. Die! Good job, Kai. Kai's level 33 now. Aqua Jet. Okay, let's see. You're more of a physical attacker, so... It's lower, but it's guaranteed to always hit first. No, I think we're good. Kai is pretty speedy, so we don't have to worry about that. Yeah, you just give up on We'll be fine. I, am, I have been so excited this month, because today is the 5th, and, um... <laughs> I get to go to Animazement in like 20 days. I am super excited for it. I have all my uh, my cosplay stuff laid out and they already released a guidebook so I'm like picking out what I want to do during the event and everything. So I believe it's uh, me, my boy, I think Peter's going. Uh, I don't remember what other friends uh, Cameron said that was going to come, but I, I am super excited. What did we use again? <laughs> I can't remember. Oh, yeah, shit. Signs level 25. <laughs> but, yeah. 
but uh, we have our, like, we picked out events that we wanted to do. Uh, definitely want to check out Artist Alley, because that is my favorite place in, like, any con. Mainly because, like, you get to support, like, a small business, you get to help an artist out, and then it encourages them to come to more events. So, I, I, I do have things on my, <laughs> my bucket list to get. Um, I always try to get one thing out related during events. Oh shit, hold on. Uh, I can't believe I lost! Are you gonna tell me the secret? You said you'd tell me a secret if I beat your ass. Gensis of the Seven Sages supports our king, and Gensis has three subordinates. They're the shadow tra No shit! <laughs> That's not a secret if everyone knows that! If I win against you, release your Pokemon. I'm good, but thank you. <laughs> I do have things I, I want to get during Anabasement. I try to get at least one thing Squirtle related. Uh, a piece of art. Um, I kind of want to get a couple things Sanji related. Um, anything from Has Been or Hell of a Boss. Mainly being like Angel Dust, Fat Nuggets. Um, uh, Angel Dust, Fat Nuggets, Octavia, or Stolas. Because they're really cute. So either like pins or keychains. Um, I try to find at least, like, one cool, like, cool old thing, you know, like, vintage- Oh, I'm so sorry, Jasper! <laughs> we'll go back and heal, I promise. Um... Cosmo. <laughs> so I- I'm excited about that. I kinda wanna get another Sanji figure. Cause I think that would look really cute on my little- <laughs> my collection I have so far. <laughs> Um, hopefully maybe I can find- because I'm- right now I'm in the, the habit of finding uh, old Pokemon games. Oh, we we're getting wiped out from this Scraggy! Okay. Because I recently just- um, not recently, I started it up at the beginning of this year of collecting Pokemon games. So I'm trying to complete, like, uh, my collection. So I have like a lit- I have like a powerpoint. Not a powerpoint, a, a, like a spreadsheet of all the games and everything, what- what console they belong to, the average price, and then like a little checkbox next to like the game and then also the case. So I'm trying to get a complete collection. So if- if I find something that's cool there that I don't have, that I definitely want it in my collection. Because <laughs> I know I can easily get the Switch games. Uh, DS ones are getting a little bit hard to find, so unless I find a good copy of uh, Soul Silver while I'm there, that'd be pretty cool. I think that's the only DS game that I'm missing is Soul Silver. Look at my living in the Charstone Cave are so beautiful because they are free from people. Yeah, I th I'm like running through my head. I think the only DS game that I'm like mainline DS Pokemon game I'm missing is Soul Silver. It's, it's crazy how much the prices of those things have, like, skyrocketed. Because I know before uh, COVID and everything, I uh, was at a GameStop and I picked up a copy of Heart Gold, And that thing was, like, 30 bucks. It was just the game, no case. But it was it was just 30 bucks. And now if, like... I went into a GameStop recently when I was going to get the headphones and everything. I was just looking at the DS games and they had a copy of Pokemon Pearl. That thing was $75. <laughs> that thing was super expensive. I like half of me kind of wanted to get it because um I don't have the case for my Pokémon Pearl. I got it and cuz when I got it from GameStop, it just had the the cartridge, not the uh, the case. So I was a little tempted to buy it just for the case. So but I didn't want to spend seventy five dollars on a game that I already had just for a case, so I'm hope because um I have to rework my uh, my birthday list because I have a list that I kind of send to people that way if they want to get me something. So I'm just level twenty six. <laughs> that way if they want to get me something, they don't have to guess or ask me. That way they like can look over a list and have an idea of what I like because I think that's a lot easier than telling someone because then it makes it seem like they put effort in, you know. So I kind of want to redo the list and put some extra stuff and take away certain things as well. And get, like, give copies. <laughs> like their business cards. 
I do have to give a new list to the Cameron, maybe Peter, um, maybe Kenzie too, or Coda. I, I kind of do want to get, I, I, I did tell Florence because I asked her, I was like, I'll go on Animazement, I know you probably, I know you like Pokemon, so is there like a certain Pokemon that I can keep an eye out for? So, and she, she like, she, she's, um, trying to get my words together, <laughs> sorry. Um, she plays a lot of Pokemon Go, she doesn't play mainline games, so, so she has like favorites, depending on what the, the swarm is for that day, or like the, what the new Pokemon is for that month, what the highlight is. So, I asked her, she's like, well, right now it's Rayquaza, which I kind of find funny because my, my boy also loves Rayquaza. That's his favorite Gen 3, yeah, Gen 3 Pokemon legendary. I kind of want to, like, um, well, his birthday's already passed, so maybe for an anniversary or something, I can get him, like, um, maybe our two favorite legendaries just hanging out, you know? <laughs> I think that'd be cute, just seeing like like uh Well I my my favorite isn't a legendary, it's a mythical because I love Victini and its story and everything. But if I I don't know if I if I could pick a legendary to like. Hmm, I'm trying to like think. A lot of the legendaries are good in their own respect. I don't know if I could pick just one, you know? Because a lot of them are trio Pokemon. <laughs> Oh, the cool ones are mythicals. I'm like going through the, the list in my head and I'm like, nah, not really. <laughs> Yeah, I, I think I'll just have to settle for Victini and then I like, guess a, a second place is kind of like uh, Celebi. Celebi's pretty cute. I do like its time thing. Like its uh, time ability kind of thing. I do hope if they ever make a Legends game, like another one, I hope it's Celebi related. Because I think that that would be cool to visit, like, I forgot the name of the place. <laughs> I think it's Johto. Like, Johto, like, before, and you get to see the uh, the legendary dogs be born. I think that would be really cool. <laughs> so, I gotta find something Rayquaza related. I'm gonna probably, for Coda, find something Star Wars related, because uh, <laughs> that's their uh, special interest. <laughs> So it wouldn't, it wouldn't hurt to, to look. But I got to write up a list and make sure I get everything that I want. Unfortunately, I don't think my my, my friend uh, K is going to be there, but it's alright. Ho hopefully next year they can come down. To... But I am super excited. I got my cosplays lined up, which I believe starting from third. I'm like thinking off the top of my head, because I made the list. <laughs> like, it's gonna be, um, starting from Thursday to Sunday, it's going to be Monkey D. Luffy, Kurumi Tojo, Sanji, and Squirtle. So I'm super excited. Mainly for the- how many fucking trash bags this lady <laughs> I keep, like, talking and I'm like, yeah, just find the trubbish. Just more trubbishes keep appearing. Mox- his moxie's, like, through the roof right now. Hell yeah. So, um, I'm super excited because at Animazement, um, uh, I believe the tickets go on sale on that Thursday, like, when the convention opens. Um, there is a maid in Butler Cafe. And there's very limited space, so you have to get them fast. And I, I cannot wait to just like sit in a cafe, Asanji. <laughs> As a proud member of Team Plasma, I will gladly battle with you. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> also, um, I told my boy. Actually, I think I told Koda and my boy while I was like, I was like, next time I jump up to Asanji. Um, just to let everyone know, I, I was born a biological female, so I have to use the women's bathroom to pee, so I, I, I told Gota, like, cause like the idea came in my head when I had to go to the bathroom, and I'm like, dude, next time I'm dressed up as Sanji and I have to go to the bathroom, 
please take a picture of me going into the, the restroom? Because I think it'd just be funny. Because, um... Just seeing a picture of Sanji walking towards a lady's bathroom. I don't know why, it just seems so funny to me. Is Jasper gonna level- Yes! Jasper! Dig! Okay! Bears and tacks. This is also be used to exit dungeons. Get rid of mud slab. I don't need it anymore. It served its purpose for a while, but now we have a better dark, a better ground type move. Also, I apologize if it sounds like I'm yelling. I'm trying not to. These headphones are like super good for like noise canceling, so I can barely hear myself. <laughs> Let's see. Um. Actually, who's the lowest right now? Cosmo, but we're not sending a fucking flying, uh, a flying psychic in front of a ground, uh, dark. <laughs> it's like a death sentence. But little, little got it. Hold on, I'm so sorry. <laughs> My, uh, my baker just texted me asking for a reference photo for a cake order I took. Take a drain it. Dude, it'll be funny. I- okay, not- <laughs> Cause there's not a lot of gyms left for a little, little to help out with since we're not- Cause, um, the ground one's done, water one isn't in, in this generation. <sighs> uh, sorry, I'm like yawning up a storm. And there's no rock. So I kind of want to use <laughs> Little Little in the Dragon Gym. Just like set up a shit ton of quiver dances, paralyze it. Like, like just be annoying and just sweep. Because <laughs> I think that would be funny. Yeah, what's up? I... Oh, she said thank you. Okay. The hope of Team Plasma. Well, it has nothing to do with you. What if it is? How do you know what the prophecy has foretold? <laughs> You're not N. <laughs> You're just a grunt. <laughs> Leave her, okay. The more and more that we get closer to finishing this game, the, the more I get excited for um, starting the second one. Because, um... I, I, I love this game, don't get me wrong. I absolutely love it. It was my first game I ever played, but since I was like... Damn, this came out like 2010. Um, <laughs> I believe I was like 7 or 8 when this game came out. So I didn't really know how to play very well. So when the second game came out, I like finally learned how to read and do like figure out what the hell was going on. And I, I loved it even more. And the second game has been a, like a favorite of mine forever because it brought back so many great characters. It can it continue the story where it left off. You get to see new places, see what's changed in the last two years. It is so good and I cannot express that enough. Can you stop? <laughs> Man, this game's a douche. I don't want to sit. Well, actually, I probably should sit take my, might as well. Alright, should I just use crunch? No, rock. Oh, yeah. Fuck it, dig. If this thing misses, I'm going to be so mad. <laughs> what the hell was I talking? Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, second game will always have a place in my heart. Like, to this day, even though I transferred all my Pokemon from Black 2 all the way up to home to have and everything, I still refuse to reset that game because just the amount of memories and like progress I made, I like, I I will never reset it as long as I live. <laughs> Which it kind of makes me want to get a second copy of it that way I can play it again. But those copies are like, one they're very hard to find, and two if you find one they're like, like a stupid amount of money. Because even though people are saying it's like a dog shit game, people are like, Wow, this is great now! Oh no. 
Oh, wait, I... <laughs> I should have healed him. I'm so sorry. I'm really serious about training. I even visit the Celestial Caves to train myself and my Pokemon. That's great. Ace Trainer Al Al Allison. I don't know why I struggled to say that name. <laughs> well, Jasper's dying right now. I'm gonna heal her real quick. Do we have lemonade? Actually, we got Moo Moo Milk. Only the best. Slash. That probably would have killed us. Yeah, that definitely would have. <laughs> um, crunch. Damn, that did a lot of damage. <laughs> we're, gonna, we're gonna high five each other underneath the ground. <laughs> Hell yeah! Eat it! Alright, Zeb Strike? Oh, you ain't doing shit against me, girl. I kinda want in the f I have so many cos- Cosplay plans that I wanna do. I really wanted to, um... <sighs> Excuse me. I really want to do a Zoro cosplay. <laughs> I know I do not have the build for it at all, but I would really love to do that. Because he. Because I, I just would love to. I do have to finish my Lilligan cosplay. I'm not very happy with it, so maybe during GalaxyCon I can finish it up and wear it out. Because I did work really hard on it. <laughs> I'm just not happy with the, uh, the skirt. Electric. Shock racing. Okay, that's cool. Uh, I don't know who else I would want to cosplay. Um. Oh, there's an item. Oh, it's in there. Tricked me. Oh, <laughs> God damn it! Even an electric place like this, if someone challenges me, I will take that challenge. That is an ace trainer. Yeah, tougher trainers. What the hell was I gonna say, though? I forgot! <laughs> Got the Oh, that's so cute! You ain't gonna live for long, though. I'm so sorry. Hell yeah. <laughs> I do want to cosplay Octavia from Hell of a Boss. I feel like that'd be really interesting. I, ju I just love her aesthetic. She is so cool. And I, I really loved um, making the... Um, I had a lot of fun making the tail for, for Vaporeon and then also uh, Squirtle. So I would love to make the tail for, uh, for Octavia, for her little owl <laughs> tail that she has. Oh shit! <laughs> I thought I thought it'd kill it. I'm sorry. Should we try Sanji? <laughs> what does Sanji have again? Oh, he has an electric wave. He can look. Look, he'll do it. You're only weak against rock and fire, and this is neither one of those things. All right, buddy. Yay! You did it. <laughs> really fast. Look at that! 28 for Sanji. Lilligant. Okay. We are a bug type. Hey! Only I can learn that move! <laughs> you know what's good about early bug bite is that like... You just get to eat any- what the fuck is it doing? Did it really confuse me? Sanji! <laughs> I 
is that, um, never mind. <laughs> the good thing with bug bite is that, like, it always, um, if it, it's, if the user is holding a berry, it will eat it and then gain the effects back. So, I, I do love bug bite. Let's go! That was fast, look at him. Look at Sanji, he's doing such a good job so far. What a good boy. Oh, another one on the wall. Oh, a star piece. That's pretty good. Ah! What do I have in the front? Oh, little guy. This thing's like super rare. <laughs> Oh, he made a little noise. Very, very cute. What's this? Hyper Potion. Okay, there is more stuff down here, so we do have to... Just real quick. Ugh! <laughs> we do kind of have to end this episode soon, which I kind of want to get back up. Like, finish the lower area and then stop here. Get out of here. I do, I'm very excited about today. Um, no, I have to work today, unfortunately, which... I mean, I get why I am scheduled, but... Um, sometimes closing shifts can be a, a bit of a drag. Oh, little guy again! Go away. Because <laughs> um, right after I'm done working, I get to go to my boy's house. So I'm very excited. Which, uh, as of uh, as of yesterday, he has officially graduated. So I'm, I'm very happy for him. <laughs> Unfortunately, I didn't get to see him walk across the stage. But tomorrow I get to go to the, like, the big one. And then there's a party afterwards, which sounds really good to me. Ah! <laughs> uh, just want to get the item and leave. Why do you must torment me like this, Bulldor? Shabbat repels. <laughs> Paralyzed seal, that's pretty good. There's a challenger up here, right? No, I was thinking the second game. <laughs> well, that hasn't been the first time that's happened that I I've confused the uh the games. I mean they do seem really similar. <laughs> Alright. Oh, come- I, I was almost there! <laughs> Let me leave! <laughs> Let me run away. Let me be free. <laughs> Thank you. Bright powder. I forgot what that does. I think that lowers accuracy. <laughs> I'm never gonna make it out of here alive. <laughs> Wait, hold on. I do want to try something. Hold on. We don't need that anymore. Not good at bags. <laughs> I'm gonna try this out. Maybe it'll work better. Oh my fucking god. <laughs> I thought it would work. Oh, it's just... That's what it meant. I'm so stupid. Yeah, here, get it. We're almost there. 
Yes! Alright. I'm gonna get right next to this guy. <laughs> well, I'm not gonna make it. It's fine. This is gonna annoy me. So. <laughs> but I can't reach it unless I battle that guy. So, um... We got through some Team Plasma members and we went down to the basement and got a couple goodies. So, in the next one, I'll make sure by the time I record again, uh, everyone in my party will be healed. So, don't worry about that. Man, you are just really annoying. <laughs> that gem is calling my name, but I know I can't reach it. <laughs> so, in the next one, we'll get through the rest of the Team Plasma members and uh, get to the end of Churchstone Cave and see what happens. But, as always, my name is Phoenix, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye!